Well guys, here we go. I've got a little bit of an unboxing video for you. Well, if you're wondering what you're looking at here, obviously it's a Starfrit brand. Um, pretty much LaForge classic pot and pan set. Uh, this baby here is a 14 piece unit, heavy duty gauge forged aluminum base basically in the uh, pot here, pot and pans. Heavy duty forged aluminum base and 15 year warranty on her. So basically you see here we got two saucepans, one kind of a great big uh, uh, pot for like cooking macaroni or something in. And kind of a nice pot here for doing hamburger helper. And then another one here for doing like straining. Another one here for doing larger stuff like great big soups and even has a bit of a, a colander or a strainer with it. So that's always nice to have. And we got ourselves three uh, frying pans here as well. And of course these are non-stick so that's always nice to have. So we'll just take a little tour continuing around the box here. You have the uh, French side of the box and coming across back over to the English uh, side over here. So of course we have a 1.1 quart saucepan with lid, a 2.7 quart saucepan with lid, and a 3.7 quart saucepan with lid and two centimeter steamer. I guess that's probably for like vegetables or something kind of fancy like that. And you have a 4.8 quart saucepan uh, with lid. Um, again, this is the like you know one of the larger ones for doing like soups and that. You have a 8 inch fry pan, a 10 inch fry pan, and a 12 inch fry pan and a 5.7 quart Dutch oven with lid. These are great for like making hamburger helpers or something where you're adding a lot of stuff to to make, uh, make it good and sometimes the little pans you know just ain't big enough. So let's tear on into this box guys and we'll get a closer look at the uh, goods. Okay guys so of course the box is upside down because it opens like kind of like a trunk if you will. So we'll pop open these little tabs and uh, kind of reveal the, the set. Now I'm gonna assume it's probably wrapped in plastic and uh, coated with styrofoam to keep it from rattling around and shipping. But uh, yeah, let's open her up and see what we got. Well, I'm half right. She wasn't, uh, you know, covered in uh, styrofoam, but she is wrapped in plastic. You have yourself your uh, Pretty much your care and use instructions as well as your warranty guide. This is guaranteed uh, non-stick for two years from date of purchase with proof of purchase against any manufacturing defects. And I imagine the 15 year warranty is probably only warranty against like the, the pot rusting through or something like that because most non-stick um, you know uh, cookware only lasts a few years before it gets, uh, you know, starts coming apart. And a lot of people say the non-stick stuff you do not want to, you know, eat because it can cause, um, you know, issues. Well, we got one lid here, uh, of course, covered in cardboard. We'll, uh, you know, tear the cardboard off of her. And uh, take it out of the plastic. It's a nice uh, glass uh, ring with a nice kind of rubber coated handle so it doesn't get hot when you're cooking something hot. So of course uh, we got the great big, I'm assuming this is probably the lid for the Dutch oven. Um, you know, kind of do the same thing, we'll peel off the cardboard and the plastic. And you have your wonderful uh, star fit. Uh, in the likely event you have defect product or missing pieces, please contact first. Um, a lot of the people, a lot of the companies nowadays are giving uh, these notices in the product. They don't want uh, to have retail returns, I guess, because uh, returns to the retail store affects them negatively. So uh, they'd rather you contact them uh, first before returning the product. So guys, I'll basically peel all this out of the plastic and the cardboard and uh, then we'll see what we got.
Okay guys, so we have her all unpacked. We have the whole garbage bag full of uh, cardboard and plastic and that all put away. That's not even including the box that was shipped in yet. But of course, this is the uh, look at her here. Well, of course, again, this is the 12 inch frying pan. This is the 10 inch frying pan and this is the 8 inch frying pan. Of course, the 8 inch uh, fry pan is a uh, good you know, for doing like a couple eggs or something, small little meal. Uh, this one here is a 2.7 quart, um, you know, saucepan. Uh, great for like making uh, macaroni for yourself or whatever's. And you got yourself a 1.1 quart saucepan here, good for doing like veggies and such. And of course, then you get on to the 4.8 quart uh, saucepan here, good for making like uh, soups and anything larger, you know. And then you got the Dutch oven here. Uh, that one here, I think this will end up being my favorite uh, piece of equipment. Uh, you know, good for making the great big dishes like hamburger helpers and all that that need uh, extra room to to stir. And then you have and then you have the 3.7 quart saucepan, which is uh, right here, and with the optional uh, steamer for you know, making them fancy uh, vegetables and stuff like that. But, of course, um, all of this comes with glass lids, which is kind of neat, covered with like the aluminum band here with a little rubber, um, you know, cushion here when you're hot handling the hot lid. But, as you guys can maybe possibly see here, there's a bit of dust and um, debris on here from, i um, guessing, probably the manufacturing process as well as the shipping that probably should be, uh, you know, wiped off before, before use. Um, so far guys, on first appearance of this here set, uh, I was looking at the little, um, you know, saucepan here and uh, I thought it was bent because uh, I'm not sure if this camera will pick it up, but you see that little dip uh, right there? I thought it was bent or something, you know, stamped wrong or whatever, right? But apparently that is a way to pour out the extra water when you're making your veggies, which is actually a good idea, um, you know. All in all guys, um, on a scale of 1 to 10 with first appearance on this here set, I'd probably give it a good 9, 9.5 because uh, it has the nice, um, you know, they're probably silicone handles and uh, it has vent holes in the glass lids and even the glass uh, lids you can see down in to, uh, you know, see the progress of your, you know, masterpiece. But, guys, gonna run all this through the old dishwasher there to get it all nice and clean and uh, spick and span for the eatings. And uh, we'll be golden. So, I guess this has been an unboxing and a bit of a first look on a 14 piece uh, non stick Star Frit cookware set. So, as always, thanks for watching Maxwell's World. Comment, subscribe, and enjoy.